I will show you how to get all the weapons in Hayes Peace. I can see that you're still not subscribed yet. Before you proceed, make sure you do so you don't miss videos like this. That boosts your luck too. All right, we'll start with the first weapon, guys, and that's the katana. And I think you guys already know how to get this. Let's do a quick showcase. There are two moves, Lion Song and Air Slash. Bam. Second move, Air Slash. That looks dope, bro. And this is something that you can buy from the Starter Island. It's just right here. As you guys can see, Sword Shop. And look at that guy's katana. It looks exactly like the katana that I have right now, bro. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. Very easy. It's not going to give you a hard time. The second weapon is the Shark Blade. Let's do a quick showcase. Shark Smash. Bam. Just a basic smash. Shark Hurricane. Okay, that's really too basic, bro. This is something that you can obtain from the shark boss located at Arlo Park or Shark Park. I totally forgot the name of that island. To make your lives easier, just pull up the map here. So I'm currently located at this island right here. So you have to go just right here. There you go. So once you're here, you just have to defeat Arlo. Damn, as you guys can see, he's got the shark sword just like mine, bro. Oh my God. And you have 5% chance of obtaining the shark sword once you beat Arlong. I'm not sure if this is worth it, but it's totally up to you guys. Again, these are the moves. One, two, 5% for just, for just those, those two, two moves, moves, you know? Yeah next weapon is two sword style or dual katana however you call it bro there are two moves cross slash bam so yeah basic cross slash right there let me do that again it's a long range bam and then twister hell yeah bro that's cool to be honest how to get this is you want to go to low town low town is located just yeah this place right here here we freaking are guys so next thing you want to do is talk to mr white so mr white is located here i'm sorry dr white what the heck as you guys can see there's two sword style right there you can buy this 100,000 belly guys one hundred thousand dollars, however you call it i already have that right now and i already showcase it with you and what's good about this is you can upgrade this to sword style v2 now this is the sword style v2 i'm gonna do a quick showcase cross slash as you guys can see the name actually didn't change you know same name of the skills but actually it's more upgraded just like that look at the twister right now bro damn it's a bit of a process on how to obtain this but i've made a separate video for you guys so you can just check the link in the description but make sure you finish this video first you know what i'm saying <laughs> next weapon is gonna be the dark blade and i do not have that at the moment unfortunately but i've made a video of that before for now the only way you can get dark blade or yoru is to buy it in the store that costs you 11.99 robux and that's it you'll have a mythical yoru blade wow next weapon is the pipe this is sabo's weapon y'all same thing there are two moves fire shot this is a long range yep it's a long range second move is flamethrower damn oh my god bro that's good for run oh bro. <laughs> it looks like a fire extinguisher man one more time fire shot okay that's a long range second move flamethrower this is really good for grinding and how to get this you need to go to the marine base i believe this is it right where morgan is located all right we're here i think this is the place i'm gonna show you the location guys there you go oh soba bro look at the pipe bro it looks exactly like my pipe man you are gay all right, this costs you 250,000 gold or 250,000 bellies. Next weapon is a maze. Look at that. Damn, that looks good, bro. First move is Earth Crash. Damn. And then second is Bagua. I think this is a dash. Oh, yeah, exactly. That's a dash. So to get this weapon, there's a process, a bit of a puzzle. But just like other weapons, guys, I've made a separate video just for this. So you can go ahead and check it. There's a link in the description. But make sure you finish the video, okay? Okay. Next weapon, the Soul Cane. This is Brooke's weapon. All right, first move, Soul Thrust. Damn, I think that's an ice that can stun your opponents. Second move is Soul Parade. Let's see. Oh, bro. Yeah, it's it's an ice, man. Let me do that one more time here. First move, Soul Thrust. Okay. Second, Soul Parade. Damn. I actually made a video on how to get this, but since you know you're watching right now, man, I got you, bro. I'm gonna show you. So you wanna go to Impel Down. So right now I'm located in this island, so Impel Down is right here. 
all right so i am finally here it looks like just a pretty normal place but this guy is actually hidden in this wall right here i mean it's too obvious right oh you know what i don't need to break it i just have to get inside that wall okay so this is the guy that sells this freaking soul cane that costs you a hundred thousand golds guys and you got this cool looking umbrella weapon look at that soul cane one of the best weapons in the game not gonna lie good for pvp next weapon krampus scythe unfortunately this weapon is unobtainable right now back in project new world there was an event you can kill a boss and this is one of the drops but still i'm gonna show you guys it z move chilling spikes oh look at that effects man same thing it's an eyes bro second is holiday spirit okay oh i think that was like christmas event or something like that and like i said this weapon is not obtainable right now i'm not sure with the devs if they're going to put this in a game once again this coming christmas you know what i'm saying next weapon guys is bicento or bicento i'm not sure what's the correct pronunciation of that there are two moves first is shattering orb let's see and fyi this is just a v1 there's a v2 version of this just like the sword style v2 you'll know that later on in this video guys second move shattering impact damn and now how to get this i'm gonna show you the location so i'm currently located here so i need to go to this place this is the marine base or marine fort all right so i am finally here so the npc is located in one of those towers i think that's the tower right there i'm gonna show you guys there you go that's the npc that i'm talking about her name is bella the senator v1 is gonna cost you 500k that's a lot of money bro but it's worth it because it's upgradable to v2 speaking of v2 actually let me correct myself <laughs> let me add more clarity to what i said it's not something that you can upgrade instead v1 is a requirement to get a v2 and that totally make a lot of sense so let me show this real quick the v2 actually the weapon looks the same but the moves let's start with z oh yo look at that bam second move chattering impact damn look at the aoe bro obviously you can tell the difference so now how do you actually get this this is another puzzle that you need to solve man this isn't something that you can get from regular bosses or something like that there is a process but your boy's got a video for you guys of course just like the other videos there is a link in the description so make sure you check it next weapon golden staff let's do a quick showcase there are two moves thunder blast that's a z damn second move thunder strikes look at that bro oh my goodness man that's dope yo now how you can get this this is something that you can get from one of the bosses in the game the thunder god or enru he's located in skypia oh my goodness i'm too freaking far bro all right so i am finally now here in the sky island so enel is located just right there let me show you guys there you go so that's our boy and it right there bro and like i mentioned earlier that you can get this golden staff if you kill enel and your drop chance is one freaking percent y'all but i would say it's worth it man look at that look how powerful that is bro damn all right next weapon sea beast hammer so let me do a quick showcase here first move water blast i don't know for some reason it's not working for me i don't want to restart bro second move sea destroyer it's like this bam but don't worry you'll see a full showcase of this so how do you get this actually so it's another process bro you can get this from sea beast obviously from the name itself of course you're gonna spawn a sea beast in this game there's a process and there's a video of that already on my channel and of course there's a link in the description feel free to go ahead and check it next weapon one of the most favorite the operation blade look at that bro let's do a quick showcase of this one is injection shot hell yeah second move electric discharge bam the goodness is this is something that you can buy in the game the seller's location is at punk hazard or hot and cold island just right here all right so i am now finally here guys so you want to go straight to the magma area or the hot area of the island okay guess what oh my god i thought it's hidden but it's actually so obvious right now damn so yep this is the guy that you're looking for bro this weapon costs you 250k and that's worth it man it's lost sword our favorite character in one piece and you can't deny you know the, the move is really op look at that bro 
Damn. Next weapon, Fishman Trident. Let's do a quick showcase. There are two moves, Water Shot, Z. Bam, oh, that's long range. Second move, Water Repulse. Damn, bro, that's quick, man. Now, how to get this? First, you have to go to the Fishman Island. Fishman Island is located here. All right, so I am now finally here, guys. And, you know, the NPC is located right here in this green quarrel-looking hill. I don't know how you call it. Just look around the map. It's just really easy to figure out. All right, so now that you found an NPC, you just can't buy it right away. You need a fork. Fork is an item drop from Neptune, the boss of this island. He's located just on the other side of this map. Like I said, you have 5% chance of obtaining that fork when you kill Neptune. And then once you have that item, all you have to do is just talk to this NPC and pay 50,000 belly. That's it. You got a trident. All right. The next sword is Ryu. Damn. Look at the sword model, bro. And I've actually made a showcase of this already. There are two moves, Bloody Barrage and Crimson Dash. This is one of the best swords that you can get in the game it's really deadly good for pvp so now how do you get this first thing you want to do is go to skull island well i'm actually at the skull island right now but it's this island in the map once you're here all you need to do is kill this boss cheer you and you have a chance of getting a scroll from this boss i am not entirely sure the drop right could be one or five percent around that and once you have the scroll all you have to do is go just right at the back of this big skull and then give that scroll to this scroll merchant and then you're gonna get this legendary raya sword which is really cool one of the best swords in the game so this is just a part one video on how to get sword and haste piece guys there are a lot of new swords that i'm not allowed to showcase yet including the triple katana i know y'all want to know how to get that but don't worry i'll make a part two video on how to get them so make sure that you guys are staying updated on my channel and that's pretty much it if you want to see more videos about haste bees there's a playlist link in the description there are other video tutorials as well feel free to check it and if you want to stay updated about this game and other one piece games and roblox make sure you subscribe turn on the bell icon so you're always updated whenever i post videos on my channel i appreciate your support guys that's pretty much it for today hope we can see you guys in my next video peace